In 1928, the first antibiotic was discovered, penicillin. It was made by a bread mold called penicillium. Today, over half of all known antibiotics are made by soil-dwelling bacteria. The most notable group are called streptomyces. Streptomyces spores land on the ground, germinate and branch down into the soil to soak up nutrients. When their food source becomes scarce, they grow upwards into the air. As the branches below the surface break down, they release numerous antibiotics into the surrounding soil. We use these antibiotics in human medicine. Spores then form and get blown away by the wind and start the process again in another area. Although these antibiotics are powerful at killing bacteria in our bodies, some forms of bacteria, like MRSA, have become resistant. Scientists are looking in places other than soil to find new antibiotics to combat antibiotic resistance. At UEA, our efforts are focused on leaf cutter ants. These amazing insects grow their own food in underground fungus farms. Ants feed the symbiotic fungus with leaves, and in return, the fungus provides food for the ants. Another important partner in this relationship a symbiotic, antibiotic-producing bacteria, including Streptomyces, which grow on the ants. The ants use their antibiotics to protect themselves and their fungus against infection. The new antibiotics not only pave the way to new treatment options, but show how multi-drug therapy can be effective at fighting off stubborn bacteria.